Well, the time is now 5.40 a.m. here on this chilly Monday morning. Right. And Alex, I was looking at the forecast and I was like, okay, let me bundle up. But I know by the time I get out of here at 12.30, yeah. I won't need that hat and jacket anymore. It's going to be some 20 degrees warmer wow. across central <laughs> Georgia. We know how it goes. We're going to be in the 40s this morning. And then once we get into the afternoon, it's going to be like, yeah, hold on to my hat because we are going to be warming up very quickly. So looking live over downtown, as I alluded to, we do have the 40s out there right now. 45 in Macon, 40 or 44 making 45 in Warner Robins, 43 in Milledgeville, and 44 to get your morning started in Perry. How about 48 over in Thomaston this morning, 44 down in Rochelle, 41 in Unadilla, and 41 in Cordial, 43 over in Swainsboro. Across the state, a fairly good range of temperatures from 54 down along the coast up to 33 in Rome, 40 wake you up in Blue Ridge this morning, and up towards the north, you're going to find colder temperatures, but not that much colder. You know, sitting at 44 in Macon, Denver, Colorado, it's only 10 degrees colder than us this morning here on this February morning. So a ridge in place over the nation's midsection. That's going to keep us not only dry, but also warm in the days ahead. Not seeing anything out there on the radar picture, and you can kind of see where the ridge is shaped, you know, going up towards the north here and then back down. So the nation's midsection is quiet across uh, the United States. Into the afternoon, as we alluded to, 61 by the noon hour, and then later on this afternoon, a high temperature in the mid-60s, upper 60s in a few spots. By tomorrow morning, Morning, we'll get a few high level clouds in central Georgia. Temperatures not quite as cold as they are this morning, maybe two or three degrees warmer, and that's going to be the general trend through the week. So each morning is going to be a little warmer than the morning previous, and each afternoon, as you can see here, is going to be a little warmer than the afternoon previous. So by the time we get into Wednesday morning, again, temperatures closer to 50 than 40, and then Wednesday afternoon, how about mid 70s for high temperatures across central Georgia? Now, as everything does, uh, all of the weather comes to an end. All of the uh, nice weather comes to an end by the time we get to about Thursday or so. Play this forward into Thursday afternoon. You can see fairly good agreement and a few storms, but mainly rain across central Georgia beginning Thursday afternoon. But watch the timeline here as we play this into Friday. There's Friday afternoon, so we are looking at a steady rainfall for their potentially 24 to 36 hours across central Georgia before the last of it gets out of here. We clear out for Saturday and for Sunday, so rain Thursday and Friday is what it looks like right now. Temperatures in the meantime, well above average average high is 62 will be approaching mid 70s by the time we get to the middle part of the week. Eight days to Valentine's Day, 39 days to St. Patrick's Day, about 62 days to Easter. So yes, spring is coming in quickly today across central Georgia looking for these temperatures to warm into the 60s, 68 or so being our high temperature later this afternoon. Again, average high is 62, so we are going well above that 70 for tomorrow, 74 for Wednesday. That will be our warmest day. And then here comes the showers and storms beginning on Thursday and Friday with highs back in the 50s by the weekend.